Hi, welcome to Free Spirit and welcome to the overall weekly spirit reading from May 17th to the 24th. So we're going to tap into all the cards. This is to get messages for our mind, body, spirit. We're going to find out messages for the big stage, small stage, everything in between. Um, I always start with the spirit messages and then we'll go into the cards. I just want to let you know the spirit message first. I was getting so much. The first thing I got even like a day ago was quantum leaps inside and out. Then as I'm getting ready to do the reading, that's when I get flooded with additional. So it was first quantum leaps inside and out. And then they were saying metamorphosing inside and out. And picture, you know how a butterfly process, they go in a cocoon, everything dissolves, then they, you know, it's a whole process. They were saying, imagine if you're doing this almost in a blink of an eye over and over and over again. That's the quickness, the quickening of metamorphosing that we're doing inside and out. And it's pretty remarkable. So an example of that, say what they began with quantum leaps inside and out or metaf um, metamorphosing inside and out, but very quickly. So say, for example, right in the present moment, you go back in, in the past, you see it with a new perspective, you have a new awareness and you're coming back to the present, you now have a whole new perspective or understanding. All of this happens in a blink of an eye and you have metamorphosed in some way. Um, very recently, I'll use an example, a family member. She got, um, it sounds so trivial, but she got a haircut yesterday, but inside and out. So she metamorphosed outside, but what propelled her for the change was inside. And now she feels different today because of the actions that she did. Like these are all um, little quickenings of bringing us to a different frequency, bringing us to a place where other things will flourish very quickly. Um, and they even ended it with nothing to something, um, making, bringing nothing to something. So almost like, you know how a plant, all of a sudden there's no flower, and then all of a sudden you look at it and there's a flower, it's that instant. And they also brought to my attention, we're also used to having something go to nothing, <laughs> but not nothing to something. And what we're seeing is things going from nothing to something, very quick metamorphosis, very quick, almost like a quantum leap um, inside and out. So to me, this really shows metamorphosing inside and out, transformations. Um, it almost feels like a quantum leap in some way, whether inside or outside. Um, so I'm really curious of what's gonna come out, but that was the messages that I wanted to share. So we're gonna tap into the Archangel messages for the journey. We're gonna tap into the energy. We're going to tap into the guidance. We're going to tap into what to surrender. We're going to tap into messages from heaven, loved ones passed on, and the guardian angels. And we had two just came out. I think there's a lot of guardian angels here overseeing this whole process. Um, and like I said, you could really be feeling backed at this time through the metamorphosis, through the changes, through the transformations inside and out. There's a quickening here, and it's for things to flourish. So I think that's why I'm posting a lot of readings about that. So let's get the Archangel messages for the 17th to the 24th, and just clear out your mind. Oh, and they're bringing me back to this week's, uh, last week's weekly, we had Change Your Life. Like, seize the opportunities that change brings. And that was the very last card. So that's bringing me to the present. We're going through a lot of metamorphosis, changes, transformation inside and out. And you could find a quickening with that. You could feel like you almost did a quantum leap of things inside and out. Okay, so the Archangel messages, 17th to the 24th. There are messages for the journey, 17th to the 24th. Ooh, right away, we are getting Queen of Raphael. So you are very psychic. That's what's leaping out at me. Our intuition has been amplified at this time and you're also feeling back supported and guided. Look at the moon, we're having a lot of moon action. You're also really illuminated and you're following your emotions, what you feel at this time. So you're kind, understanding, giving psychic, but the psychic is really leaping out at me. Um, we've been getting that a lot. So definitely follow your heart. It's a love of home and family, trustworthy psychic information. Yep, that's what you're going by. You're also feeling really backed and supported with what you're doing and you're letting that be the wave that you're following that's carrying you at this time. You're paying attention to your feelings. You're very psychic at this time. 
That's what I'm getting. That's the wave that you're riding. And a new love of home, family. You're following your heart. Trustworthy psychic information. You could be feeling really tapped in at this time. And that's what's carrying you forward. Yeah, and look at this. And to what? Here it comes. This is new clarity, new understanding, page of Michael. So here we have an exciting new challenge. You have what it takes to succeed. Review the contracts or documents very thoroughly. So something's coming in here that's going to be new. This could be part of the transformation, bringing things to a new flourishing or something. But um, here you are definitely getting new opportunities here that probably are going to bring you more happiness in the home, family, your life, but you're definitely, there's going to be new challenges, new things to work on, new ideas is what I always think of, just wanting to come out. Four of Ariel, which is probably going to give us more stability, security in the home. What you give, you also receive, being resistance to change, extremes in how you save or spend money. <clears throat> We've had, excuse me, <clears throat> I can hardly speak. We've had a lot of concerns about money. There's some news coming in here, some opportunities that are gonna help us when it comes to our finances, new foundations. This could be the metamorphosis that where we're feeling it. Um, where there was restriction, we could feel opening up. We could feel that we are gonna have new prospects when it comes to money, abundance, foundation, security, stability, things like that. So the changes in how we spend money. So I feel like the metamorphosis, the news or opportunities are coming in to transform our finances, our stability, our security. So that's the wave. <laughs> so this is why it's going to be uplifting. You're also following your psychic intuition and guidance to make the most of these opportunities. So we got that one. They want me to continue. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, 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 that's what's coming in. So here we have the chariot. Again, this is what we got last week for this. We're getting again, we're still on the chariot. The divine is moving us, absolutely. So stay determined, self-control, career advancement, acknowledgement of success by others. We're being moved, and are you ready for this? <clears throat> Excuse my voice, three of Ariel, which I always say is the new major arcana for this time. We're all working together. It's going to be a time that you're collaborating with others right now. We're being moved literally for career advancement, project advancement. This could be part of the transformation that we're all playing a part of working together. So it's doing what you love, a time of great personal growth in your career or artistic endeavors, working with others in a cooperative manner. So that's where the transformation is going to be. It's going to be in work projects. It's going to be and opportunities. We're still being moved on that chariot. You go forward for advancement, collaborating, working very well with other people at this time. And so it, that's going to bring us new stability. These two pink cards are in the physical. So there's opportunities for advancement. There's divine moving. This is the chariot we had it before where you're moving forward to collaborate with other people on opportunities, advancement. There could be really profound transformation on that because look, we're moving quickly. Knight of Michael. So this is the quickening. It could almost feel like a quantum leap into action. Um, like I said, there's transformations on the inside and out. Queen of Raphael is like inside psychic information and um, like a wave of that. And then the new opportunities in the physical. So all movement, chariot is movement. Knight of Michael is movement. Time to move quickly, choose logic over emotion. You can't make this up, sudden changes. So that's what I mean, sudden changes, sudden um, metamorphosis, sudden uh, transformations. It could be within your work, your projects, opportunities that are available now. Definitely things that are going to help us in the physical, um, bring new things to life. Um, look at the chariot and the night. I mean, we are moving, moving, moving. This is action, action, action. And it could be quick and sudden changes. What did they say? Nothing to something, right? And you're following what you're getting. It's um, And there's the new opportunities and here working together. Um, so definitely moving, moving, moving quickly. So this is a time for changes, sudden changes, metamorphosing, um, from nothing to something, really nothing to something, especially when it comes with work or projects or um, things to move forward on. Um, 
to achieve. Um, you're gonna see that on the inside and out, but a lot with projects and work and working really well together. Um, this is gonna create uh, more stability, structure um, with abundance. Um, so let's get the energy, 17 to 24. Oh, that almost wanted to turn in 17 to 24. Yeah, look, at you can't make this up, action. So it is a time of action. These are three cards, Major Arcana, Knight of Michael, and this action card. This is aligned action, divine action again. So there's gonna be divine action. I would say metamorphosis, um, transformation with this kind of action on new opportunities, new clarity, um, working very well together in the physical. Um, yes, 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 our heart is in it as well. So this is just a time, it's time for action. Uh, time for action moving forward, sudden changes, um, time to move quickly. So just like they said, it's like nothing to something. Like if you look at a plant, one day there's no flower, another day there is a flower. It's like, it's that kind of action going on here, inside and out. Um, and this is inside and out action aligned. So let's get the guidance. So there's gonna be a lot of action moving forward. Divine is moving forward and you're moving forward. Sudden changes, opportunities to work together, collaborate, make something from nothing. That, that's what it reminds me of the Four of Ariel, too, when you are holding on tightly, but now all of a sudden there's changes with that. What are the guidance? What is the guidance? This is action, action, movement, movement. <laughs> action, action, movement, movement, working well with other people. There's new opportunities coming in, absolutely. Yep, look at this, beautiful, beautiful golden opportunities. Look at the wave, reminds me of the Queen of Raphael. You are loving this wave, okay? This is a wave of action, and it's almost like the you're being carried at this point. So important doors are opening for you right now. Walk through them. That is what they're saying, and you're being guided to walk through them. See the guidance back here? So as things, action, 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 doors opening, you're going right through them. This is what they meant by this transformation. Um, metamorphosis, um, rising, uh, this whole movement, momentum, this wave, it's action, action, action that you're riding. Look at this, action, 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 ride the wave. Um, ride the wave, important doors are opening. Couldn't be any clearer, golden opportunities. And you know it and you're trusting it and that's the wave too. So let's get to what to surrender. Sorry, my allergies are really um, acting up. That's why my voice goes out sometimes during the video. Oh, it's like the allergies are kicking. Okay, so what can you surrender? This is very positive action, action, golden opportunities, something from nothing. That's what they said in the beginning, right? So it could be, that's the wave. Like all of a sudden, it's like sudden movement. Surrender your need to always be right. This is going to help you, especially if you're collaborating with others, right? So give others the gift of letting them be right. Be yielding, not rigid. This will help resolve conflicts, improve your relationships. You want to be flexible. You don't have to scream you're right all the time to get along. We had uh, that collaborating energy back there for all things in the physical. You want things to work better. You want to compromise. You, want, you don't have to say that you're right all the time. Let others be right as long as the result is what you want. <laughs> you know, um, it's a better way to work, especially in working relationships. Oh, gosh. Some of these, I, you know, I'm talking and then the card does not fall out because maybe I touched on it. So what else can we surrender in our relationships and Surrender negative thinking. Surrender the negative thinking. You have control over your thoughts. When a negative thought surface says, surface, they say thank you for sharing and quickly refocus on positive affirmations. They want us to stay positive. We're moving to better here. We're going through open doors. Um, there's been a lot about surrounding yourself with positivity and keeping your thoughts positive. Keep making that switch. We're heading to better, no doubt about it. Surrender to your full power. Love, love, love. Your life is calling for you to step into your full power rather than playing it small. This is a recurring message. They're helping us to really claim our full power, our divine power. Look, she's riding that. Well, she's standing beside it, but it reminds me, you're going forward. Action, action, action. When you ride through these doors, you're riding through confidently. 
and that's an inner change. So when they said a metamorphosing inside and out, that's the metamorphosis inside and out, that you're rising to meet these challenges. You're moving forward on the chariot, in the physical, sudden changes, moving forward, action, action, moving forward, but you're moving forward in your full power. So that means releasing the negative thinking, being flexible, not always having to be right, but you're and you don't have remnants of low self-esteem. Your life is calling for you to stay in your full power rather than playing it small. So that you're riding this wave. Look at how she's risen up in like full beauty and glory, and right? So that's how they want you to be. Um, important doors are opening for you right now. Walk through them. And it's metamorphosis. You're going through riding that wave. Action, action, action. Sudden changes inside and out. Like they said, we metamorphosed inside and out and the metamorphosis inside is going into more full power as we're riding forth on opportunities open doors so it truly is a metamorphosis inside and out um it truly is yeah okay so let's get the messages from heaven but we're moving forward metamorphosis inside and out going through doors opening golden opportunities and they're saying, let the animals on earth support you and feel their unconditional love. You could be feeling divine support. You may have pets, um, but also then all animals in nature could be very supportive and show you unconditional love at this time or be used in divine ways. I always say like birds, butterflies. Nature itself could be very supportive to you right now. Nature, animals. We're getting, yeah, go out and plant new life seeds, sow for your future. Not to mention, we're heading towards a full flower moon, a full flower moon. Like they said, <clears throat> it can go from nothing to something very quickly. And this was a metamorphosis inside and out. And you have unconditional love backing, uh, like almost all of nature is what I'm getting, not just animals, but like all of nature, like the soil in which you were planting things, you're backed by the universe. Like as you're going forward, um, planting your seeds for your future, know that the, everything's supporting you. Like your loved ones passed on are all these lights and the soil that you're planting on, it can go from nothing to something like this. And we're, we're metamorphosing really quickly inside and out. Moving, 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 and in your full power on the inside and outside, moving, moving. And this is important. Doors are opening, so walk through them. So you could feel things are really opening up, that you're coming into more full power. Things are opening up. You're going out to plant new life seeds, sowing for your future. And it can go from nothing to something. And in that, hold that vision as you go forward. Because back here it says surrender the negative thinking and things like that. So it's like, <laughs> you know, they're saying go out and plant those new life seeds. Page of Michael is the new opportunities. And then it's action, action, action. And this is divine movement. This is going to help us with our finances, abundance, uh, security, stability. They definitely want you to be in your full power on the inside so that your power Powerfully going through new doors, powerfully going out and planting new life seeds. And this is, and to always keep in your mind's eye, it can go from nothing to something like that. Like as quickly as you did a quantum leap in your into your full power in a second in some way, like the action that you're doing in the physical, it can go from nothing to something <laughs> like this. They keep on like making me feel like it's quicker, it's quicker. It doesn't have to go through the whole slow process like the butterfly process. It could be in a blink of an eye. It can go from nothing to something. Um, so let's get the quantum, I mean quantum. They keep on mentioning quantum. It could be quantum changes, quantum flourishing inside and out. Quantum flourishing inside and out. Okay, <laughs> quantum flourishing, going from nothing to something. And on the inside, from nothing, you know, from feeling low to full power. You see what I mean? Action, action, action. Um, yeah, so let's get the guardian angel messages. Oh gosh, right away, we're getting, yeah, look at, you can't make this up, manifestation. So believe in yourself, trust your instincts, follow your heart. You know, this was, I mean, they're summing up the whole thing. So you got to trust your psychic ability. You have to follow your heart. It literally said, follow your heart, trustworthy psychic information. Manifestation, when you go through these open doors like that, you go through like the delicious, you know, queen of Raphael, where you follow your heart, you have trustworthy psychic information, you're going forward, planting your seeds in your full power. Like definitely in your full power, believe in yourself, trust your instincts, follow your heart, for in doing so you shall manifest all your desires, your heart desires. The life you have for so long aspired to create will soon manifest. Go out and plant those new life seeds and so for your future. They're saying that it can go from nothing to something. 
You know, that's what the divine action is for. You to be in your uh, full power, riding forward, taking action, sudden changes, going through open doors, manifesting, planting new life seeds, um, manifestation. I mean, believe in yourself, trust your instincts, follow your heart, for in doing so, you shall manifest all your heart's desires. The life you have for so long aspired to create will soon manifest. This is growing. Like, this is, the, you have the divine backing um, it's metamor metamorphosing, it's transforming, it's flourishing, it's flourishing, it's like quantum flourishing, quantum flourishing inside and out, we have guilt, and we have gratitude, okay, we have guilt, you do not need, this comes out a lot, you do not need another's approval to feel worthy of love, so that helps you step into your full power, regardless of what you've done or what you think you failed to do from your soul's perspective, there's neither right nor wrong, Every experience in life is here to help you expand your awareness of love so that you may embrace ever greater spheres of wisdom. That's the transformation inside and out, the quantum leaps that they were talking about inside and out. You can in embrace ever greater spheres of wisdom. You've done nothing wrong. This helps you embrace more full power on the inside. Then here's gratitude. Thank you. This is a heartfelt thanks to you from someone you recently helped in some way. I, your guardian angel, also wish to thank you for the unconditional love you emanate to the earth, humanity, and those around you. And that's why you're getting full unconditional love back. Let the animals on earth support you. Feel their unconditional love. Feel the love of all of nature, of earth, the animals, everything is supporting you back because you're, you've been outpouring. So there's gratitude from the universe to you for your energy, for what you've been outpouring. Thank you. This is a heartfelt thanks to you from someone you recently helped in some way. I, your guardian angel, also wish to thank you for the unconditional love you emanate to the earth, humanity, and those around you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You are eternally blessed. May peace, grace, and love forever guide you along your sacred path. Remember, you're guided. I mean, gratitude here. They're guiding you, and you know that because you're psychically in tune. Um, but they're literally gratitude for what you're outpouring. And action, 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 metamorphosing. It can go from something to n nothing to something pretty quick, like a flower. Like it began, uh, you look at a flower pot. One day there's no flower, all of a sudden the flower bloomed, right? So they're saying, sow your seeds, go through that like this. In your full power, go through those doors confidently. Important doors are opening for you right now. Walk through them, full power on the inside, action, action, action on the outside. There's a lot about collaborating energy. So you wanna come, you know, this part about surrender your need to always be right. That's in your relationships with other people, working with them. Um, and surrender negative thinking. That's the inside metamorphosis to make sure that you're staying positive, that you're not dwindling your full power by being negative in your head. There's going to be a lot of changes with stability, security, because here's the plant coming up and it came up on four of aerial where there could have been restrictions before. And three cards of action. I mean, quick action, sudden changes. Action, 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 and open doors and opportunities. So definitely manifestation. Let go of anything that holds you back from full power. Going through those doors like this. Um, and know that literally go out and plant your life seeds and sow for your future. So I wish you all the best for the 17th to the 24th. Action, action, action. Manifestations, transformations, quantum leap flourishing. <laughs> quantum leap flourishing on the inside and out. Quantum leap yeah, they metamorphosing on the inside and out. Um, and it's beautiful because it feels like everything is opening up, uh, blossoming, blooming, flourishing. Um, and it's quick, quick, quick. That's how they began, like going through the whole process like this in a blink of an eye, quick, 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 quick. And we had all these action cards and on all of this. So definitely great open doors. Keep planting your life seeds. Things are going to be blooming, blossoming, flourishing, changing, metamorphosing with an quickening because they kept on mentioning like quantum quantum meta metamorphosing quantum flourishing on the inside and out trust what you're getting because the psychic abilities are off the charts and whenever uh, questioning what to do you follow your heart because that's your guidance as you're moving forward to manifesting and blossoming and flourishing lots of gratitude to you too for the energy and the outpouring of what you're putting out like what your energy is and what you're growing what you when they say go out and plant new life seeds so for your future know that you're supported in this like the soil the earth everything is supporting what you're planting and they want you to go forward through open doors in your full power. All the best to you. Take care. Bye-bye.